Hey, what's up guys? It's Simply Pete here. And this video is about my clan, and I really want you guys to join it. It's called Seven Legends with the clan tag hashtag QYJ98UR. Please join this clan as we are really awesome. We are the top seven players are legends, as you know, because our clan named Seven Legends, you know. And we have 19,314 trophies with a lot of good donations per week average. If you want to join, it's 1,600 trophies. You need at least 1,600 trophies to join, but I'm pretty sure you could get there, right? Now, there are some rules about this clan, though. First of all, there will be no hoppers or spammers. If you are a hopper or spammer, get out. We don't want you. Okay, hoppers and spammers are not welcome to you. Another one. And another important rule is if you're not active for more than two days in a row and you don't tell any of the co-leaders or the leader that, then you will be kicked because we will have no inactive players. All our players are will be active and will donate. If you don't donate, you're gonna get kicked. All of our players have a good donating. Well, most of our players have good donation averages. Obviously, if you first join, you're probably not gonna have that many donations. But in a week, we are expected to have at least 30 donations, which isn't a lot to ask, really. Especially since we are at more than 1,600 trophies, so you could probably donate more cards, four comments at least. And you can donate one grand, which gives you 10 cards. Well, it counts as 10. So, it, it, it isn't that hard, guys. 30 donations in your first week isn't hard. So, please, if you want to join, please remember to donate. So, right now, I'm showing a replay of our plan. This is a friendly battle. And this is just to show you guys that our clan, this clan is actually good. Like, we're not what you think, oh, why should we join this clan? They're just advertising because they want people. Yes, we do actually want people, but this isn't a bad clan, guys. This clan's actually pretty good. Right here, we have a friendly battle between Chris1236 and XX No Land XX. It looks like No Land X, XX No Land XX, weird name. It's actually winning with the hog rider. The hog rider. So they're both using a hog rider, but I don't think Chris really knows what he's doing. No land sure does. Since he already got his other tower and Chris barely touched it. I don't think Chris has even used the freeze ball yet, has he? Maybe once, yeah, I think he used it once only. And then now no land looks like he's gonna no he's not gonna get the three star. Well, it looks like he was gonna get the three star. It's not enough time left. Okay, let's speed this up a bit. Yep, not three star. Oh, uh, especially since the hog went the wrong place. Okay, now let's go to another replay. This is not gonna be a friendly battle. So you guys actually know how well our players like play. Yeah, let's see. Where is it? Not uh, right here. This battle is between. Log, Logging Just Man and Martin Tan from Mega uh, something. So Log Just Man is cycling through his deck. Like how I hate when I love watch T Royale and then they just like keep flipping their cards but they never put it. It's really annoying. So Logging started with some spear goblins. But he countered it with a musketeer, and Long just placed minions and musketeer to kill that Valk. I meant Valk, by the way, sorry. There goes the wish and the musketeer by Marnie Pan to counter Log push. Just man push. Let's just say just man because Log man. It's just weird. So it looks like Logging Just Man is winning so far and he hasn't even used the hog yet. So basically he's winning without using the foot. 
Now I'm guessing Martin is going to get a little minion. Uh, wow. He did air a little pickle. And Martin can't is really going to catch it. So, just me. Just do watch now. It's not going to The, um, he doesn't have any power to do that stuff, Pekka. And the bomber is actually going to completely kill those barbarians. Because, well, just that only has that so. Let's see what he does. Oh my gosh, so that bomber actually goes in front of the Pekka. Uh, no So it looks like Lolly and Jeff Man is not doing well here, but that has a hell of a Except there's still all those things. So it doesn't look too good. They did less favorites than that, actually. Lolly and Jeff Man is actually winning, and the Pekka is paused for the first time. He's probably gonna match it. No, Going to the next replay by Chris this time. Against another actual player that's not in my clan. And it has your name. Which means it's pretty hard. So let's beat it up to two times. And uh, that guy starts to come up. Chris counted the little picture. The move. Which can it? Oh, no. That's not. Cannon wasn't a good move. But, I'm gonna zap it, yep. Although that, that push did do a lot of damage. Basically destroyed the tower. Let's see. Okay, so I'm guessing the Asian guy is gonna use a giant push, yep. And then Chris is gonna push for the other tower. Which I don't think is a good idea because he hasn't even got that tower, got to this tower yet. That's what some people do. Literally, some people, my tower has like, what, 300 health left, and they still need two fireballs, but they think they got the tower, so they start going to the other tower, and then it turns out I win at the end. Okay, so this time he actually, he actually got both towers. And he's actually just Uh, that has big little farm there, but it's fine. Maybe, nope, not too far, but that other guy didn't even get one out. Not too far, but he's got both towers, so this is why my, this clan is good. Seven Legends is a good clan. Our players are good. And now I'm gonna oh, um, show the last one by Just Man again. again. From Montaloma to Jose and probably Spanish. So two times speed. They start out with a zap spear goblins, okay? That's a pretty good thing because those are level 9 spear goblins and those are powerful. Okay, let's see here. Musketeer. He's gonna kind of with a valve. Now spear gobs. Uh, another musketeer. Probably a musketeer hog. I'm guessing Reeks is gonna do musketeer hog freeze. Most likely. No, he's using the bomber. Okay, now hog. Oh. Oh, uh, the musketeer went. Uh, knew what he was gonna do freeze. 
That did a lot of damage. Oh my gosh. That would have been a really good push if he didn't have the fireball. Okay, so now Log just man got his tower because Reeks was out of elixir. Uh, okay, Reeks doesn't look very good to me. Yeah, he doesn't look very good. Okay. See, the, our clan is good and our players are good. They act, they know how to play. Not like Reeks, who doesn't have any idea how to play this game. Although he did get the tower, but still. This even is gonna end up as a tie or Lodge just has to win. And I know Reeks is not gonna win because he's not good. You could already tell. Although, one thing is that Reeks does have level 7 Fireball. I mean, level 7 Hog Rider with a freeze. And that, that is dangerous, okay? Because that's powerful. Yeah, I think it's gonna be a tie. Uh, yep, tie. Super close though. If they just had five more seconds, log just man one and one. Okay, remember guys, join seven legends. It's a really good plan. Our donation is four thousand five hundred twenty-eight, and Kevultron, our leader, his donation is six hundred eighty-seven pieces. And look at his total donation: twelve thousand two hundred forty. Remember, if you want to join, please donate. Also, um, also, please remember that hoppers and scammers are not welcome. So if you even think about doing that, don't even try. Okay, we're just gonna immediately kick you out. Please join this clan, Seven Legends. Remember, hashtag Seven Legends strong forever. Thanks for watching, please like and subscribe for more videos.